This short video will show you the correct way to use the active K12 probiotics, the um, revolutionary new treatment to help uh, maintain fresh breath and a clean, healthy mouth. Probiotics are based on research uh, done in New Zealand, and uh, the attempt here is to repopulate the oral flora with Streptococcus salivarius K12, which is a uh, bacterial strain which uh, is found in all people with fresh breath. Um, the way to do that is you first need to remove the unhealthy bacteria and then you can re your mouth is in a position to be repopulated with the good bacteria. So there's a uh, multi-step process to follow in order to have that be done. The first step would be to um, rinse with active oxygen serum and uh, you actually use a citrus juice on day one. Um, there's actually, a, this is a 30 day regimen. Uh, but you actually do a different routine on the first day of the week and then the other days two through six are a slightly um, altered routine. So we're going to start with the day one instead. So day one, you take uh, 16 drops of the active oxygen serum. It doesn't have to be exactly 16, but close. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Okay, and you fill up the rest of the way on here you'll notice a red line and a black line. We use the, the red line today, and you fill up the rest of this with any kind of uh, citrus juice up to that red line. And then you simply uh, rinse and swish it around your mouth for a good 30 seconds. I'm going to use this cup here to spit out in after I'm done. And you want to make sure you do that for a good 30 seconds. When you're done with that, you um, will then want to rinse with some water. Okay, now we use the, uh, the active K12 probiotics. So what we've just done right there is to level the playing field, so to speak. And um, we've attempted to neutralize any of the uh, what we call bad bacteria in your mouth. And now we're ready, it's receptive to receiving the good probiotic bacteria instead. So we take uh, one spoonful of the active K12 probiotics and put it into the cup here. And we add uh, water up to the red line. Okay, and then you just swish that around. Um, You'll notice that the probiotics have a um, little bit of a uh, peppermint flavor. Um, it's very pleasing, very nice to the taste. And uh, that's, that's, that's day one right there. Uh, you start with the active oxygen and fruit juice first, and then the probiotics and uh, the water second. And these instructions are all laid out very carefully in the, uh, in the directions you'll get with the, with the products. So that's day one. On day two through six, you take a very slightly modified approach. Uh, it's very similar, except you just don't need to use the, uh, the fruit juice, and you don't use quite as much active oxygen serum. So uh, starting day two, in the morning when you get up, you'll uh, again use, this time, eight drops of the active oxygen serum. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. And you add some water. And do it again, just swish normally. Again, it's very important to make sure you rinse for at least 30 to 60 seconds. Uh, I'm not giving it nearly enough time here for the sake of the video, but it's very important to take your time when doing that. After you're done with that, uh, you can then use the probiotics just like before. Uh, you take one level, uh, level teaspoon. Add it in and just fill it up with water to the red line again. You might want to just shake it up a little bit so it mixes well in your mouth and it'll, it'll mix when you rinse it around anyway. Spread it out and you're all done. And that's days two through seven. And on day eight, you would start the whole routine all over again just like you were on day one. So there's uh, four different cycles, each cycle of seven days. 
and that's the uh, active K-12 uh, probiotic regimen.